I can't tell you how, how important she's been to our team, you know, and, uh, you know, obviously uh, uh, it, was, it was tough for her uh, because all of her time was spent with uh, Mr. Benson. I mean, you know, especially the, the last month or so before he passed away. And so she was 100% involved with that. But, uh, you know, I would say that uh, after the, the funeral, uh, she was so important to what everything that happened with us. You know, the first thing she did is that she came over and spoke to the team uh, the next day and said that, uh, you know, I'm going to be there for you guys. And when she said be there for you guys, she was at every practice. She flew cross country uh, to see every single game that we played. Uh, she had, she ate lunch with us every single day. She was at every single practice. And she told the guys in the games that we won, the games that we lost, you know, how proud she was of them and how supportive she was of them. And, uh, you know, to me, uh, it 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 made our guys feel really good that uh, you know she was 100% committed to us, and uh, you know as coaches she always talked to us and she always talked about how proud she was and uh, you know the competitiveness that we played with and uh, you know just having her there and having her in those kind of situations uh, uh, it it made it great you know and I mean you're talking about someone uh, who's grieving you know I mean th this is days after, you know, uh, burying her, her husband. And she said, this is the way that Mr. Benson would want it. You know, he would say, hey, you know, pick it up and let's go. And, uh, and, and, and uh, for her to, to have that kind of uh, commitment to us, uh, it couldn't do anything but, but make you feel good.